Hello, I'm Karen. And I'm Claudia. And we're going to talk to you a little bit about uh, the learning resources and to say something about what they are. So Karen, uh, Ajami Project has developed this, uh, this online module. What is the module and how is it organised? So the online module is organised in a set of units and the units we have drawn from all the literature that has, that has been published, all the things that we know are important when we think about the gender media relationship and particularly issues around inequality and how some media houses have tried to change, um, to challenge those inequalities in their own organisations. And the, the module is actually organised in thematic units. Uh, so there are some themes uh, that we have decided were uh, more relevant because it's also the, the kind of issue that most people would think about if they think about gender inequality in the media. But then we also decided to include some other aspects uh, which may not be as well known. So I think when, when we think about gender and media, and particular, particularly inequalities, we'll often think about issues around representation. So we're all quite, many of us are very familiar with issues such as stereotyping, the way in which women and men appear in news or in media more generally. But as, as you're saying, Claudia, we also thought that there are other issues, other kind of factors which are part of the gender media relationship, which sometimes we don't really think about in addition to representation. So maybe you can say something about some of those other themes. Other themes that we, we do believe they're very much interconnected. So for instance, I've been uh, developing some um, uh, resources on policy. So why are media policies and media regulatory mechanism and provision important in order to promote gender equality? But then we're also aware of the fact that the media environment and the profession, the journalistic profession, is changing very much uh, with the digital context. Uh, and so we also included a unit on how is uh, digital transformation transforming the profession. And of course, uh, if you want to change things, it's not just about understanding what goes on in the newsroom and what are maybe the numbers of women and men and the different position or issues uh, related to recruitment, but we also need to be aware of the many efforts that have been done in different places uh, in terms of advocacy. So how do individuals and organizations advocate for gender equality? Um, around the world for in, in the media context and so there are units dealing with all these different aspects.